hey guys welcome back this is the part 3 of uh, our user authentication with device and rail 7 series in this lecture we will learn how to redirect users after sign up to a custom page so far you have seen that we create an account i mean when we create an account or we sign up a new user a confirmation confirmation email is sent to the user's email and the page redirected to default root page of our application. In this lecture, we will implement a custom route page and after creating user's account before confirmation, we will redirect users on that custom page. So let's start implementing that feature. So to implement the feature, first open your project. Okay. And in the project, let's go to the registration controller, which you can find in app controllers users. So now open the registration controller and come to the bottom of the file. Okay, in the bottom, you can see a method that uh, def inactive sign up path for. Okay, so we need to uncomment this method. Okay, and here you can see another method that is after sign up path for. So, what is the difference between both after sign up path for and after inactive sign up path for? So, after sign up path for is used when you are not using confirmation module. Okay, it means so. It means that whenever you create or whenever you sign up with a new user, it is just signed into the system and they can, uh, the authentication has been done and they can start using the features. But after inactive sign up path means that first user has been created and then a confirmation email has been sent. And unless the user confirm their account, the user is considered as an inactive user. Okay, so that's why we need to add our custom redirection page into the after inactive sign up path for method okay so let's uh, remove this line and we will add our custom path okay so to add the custom path first open the home controller and in home controller let's add an action def after registration path okay. and in this after registration path save it and make an entry into the routes file for it open the routes.rb okay and here we will add the get confirmation pending and now let's make this to the home controllers after registration page action let's write home hash and the path name Okay, now we need to create a path for this file, a, a file for this action. So open the home controller into the home control a into the app views home, create a new file, save it as html.erb. Okay. And in this after registration path html.erb, let's uh, uh, add some bootstrap styles. So open the get bootstrap.com, click on the get started, open a component and this should be the card. Okay, so let's open it. Let's copy this. Add a grid here first. Give class all LG6 and mx and in this tape just paste it and correct the indentation and now open this page in browser first before making it a redirection page okay let's paste this link here okay so the page looks like this okay now change this text uh, let's make it call lg add and let's say add an sg tag here let's say information pending let's make this card header to bg primary refresh it Text to white and in this text as well, let's say hey, 
200 to 1 step away and then change some text here as well he sent you a confirmation email email is oh, check your inbox Click on let's make it in some strong tape. And remove this button as well because we do not have any feature so far, so we will not allow users to go anywhere. Let's save it and now your page looks like this. And now we will create a new user and after creating that user the user will be redirected to this page okay rather than default sign in page so first copy this link and add a path here confirmation pending path oh no this plus sign okay so now whenever you create a new user before confirmation then user will be redirected to this page okay so let's see how it works click on the settings open the sign up form let's provide details here let's say ravi share contact number say hello india username let's say ravi1308 and email ravi at the red example.com provide password here and now click on the sign up button so when you click on sign up button here you can see that after uh, signing up with this user you are redirecting you are redirected on the custom page and this is the confirmation email now you can click on the confirmation account okay and the welcome email has been sent as well and now you are redirected on the sign up page and since the same way we added the custom page for the after sign up path you can do the same thing for after sign in path after sign up uh, sign out path or after confirmation path okay and you just need to make appropriate uh, uh, you just need to add appropriate path there where you want to redirect your users okay so that's all from this lecture in the next lecture we will add a resource to the application and then we will implement role based authorization for the user. Uh, but for now, I would like to request you to try to implement uh, after confirmation path and after sign in and sign out path to get more compatible with this device handling things. Okay, so thanks for watching this and let's meet into the next lecture. Till then, Tata, goodbye, take care and stay safe.